you're scared or nervous to get a tattoo, this video is for you. I felt like this was a sit down type of video. So this is gonna be a little bit different from the types of videos that I usually post on this channel, but I get so many comments saying that you guys wanna get a tattoo, but the fear of getting a tattoo is holding you back. And even though I have a crap ton of tattoos right now, I could relate 100%. So in today's video, we're gonna be talking about my first tattoo experience to hopefully then inspire you to shake off that fear and get into the tattoo chair. If you have any type of fear of getting a tattoo right now, leave a comment below on what fear you're having. And if you already have a tattoo, comment below your first experience when getting a tattoo. I would love to hear. And who knows, maybe your story will also help people gather that courage. But hey, if this is your first time here, my name's Mike and this is Manly Man TV. And on this channel, I post weekly men's lifestyle videos and tattoo videos just like this one. So if that's the kind of stuff you're looking for, consider subscribing and don't forget to hit the bell notification just so you don't miss a thing. Now this video is unscripted, but let's get into it story time. So let's start off with the reason why I first wanted to get a tattoo. Pretty much my whole family has some type of tattoos on their body. And I remember when I was younger, I would always see my dad's cool tattoos. He has Godzilla and superheroes. And you know, growing up, I love superheroes and I just thought it was like the coolest thing. So growing up and being around tattoos, my brother, my sister, my dad, I just started to grow a liking to them. I thought they were beautiful and awesome. Even though I fell in love with tattoos at a young age, I was just totally afraid of everything that had to do with the process of getting a tattoo. I was afraid of the needles. I was afraid of picking something that I might regret uh, later on in life. Just the whole nine. But my main fear was the needle part. Ever since I was younger, I hated needles with a passion and that's what tattoos are. A bunch of needles just poking your skin for hours on end. So I'm like, oh my God. Like, so I started doing research on all the things that I talked to you guys about on this channel. There really wasn't that many, there really still isn't that many tattoo videos out there talking about you know, certain things like the pain and, um, you know, what to get and, and just what to do as far as, uh, you know, the whole tattoo process. There was some articles and videos online, but you know, it, when it comes to tattoos, everybody has their own opinion on how they feel. And some people think that they hurt worse than others and which is true, but, but you know, me being inexperienced at the time, all this stuff was getting into my head and building that fear up. You know, after doing all this research, well, at least trying to, I decided to, you know, get my friend. He said he wanted a tattoo also, it was his first tattoo, and head into a tattoo shop and just pretty much see what happens. So when we got to the tattoo shop, I really didn't do any research on the shop itself, on the artist, which is, you know, one of the worst things that you could do before getting a tattoo, pretty much. I went to the first guy that was available. You know, I let my friend go first. We were both gonna get chest pieces. Now my friend got in the chair and he was this big, you know, muscular guy. As soon as that needle hit him, he was like freaking out and like in all kinds of pain and, and seeing that happen, somebody I know getting a tattoo done and seeing them in so much pain, I was like, oh my God, I don't think I could do this. But I didn't say that at first. I let him, you know, he had to complete the tattoo. But I was freaking out in my own mind. And oof, that, that buzzing noise. The buzzing noise when I first heard that in the tattoo shop, I hated it. It was like freaking me out. So he got done the tattoo. It was my turn next. And I was out couldn't do it. I just walked outside, didn't say anything to anybody. I was so pissed off at myself. I left. I got in the car, my friend was mad at the fact that I made him get a tattoo first and you know we were supposed to get it together but I just couldn't do it. I, I just wasn't able to sit myself in that chair to get this tattoo done. Even thinking about it right now, it, it, you know, it still gets me mad at the fact that I let this fear get a hold of me and I, I had no courage. You know, I was just that scared. Now I know a lot of you might be thinking that, wow, this sounds really dramatic, but this is this is how my mind was working. I had the worst anxiety ever when it came to this whole process. But after leaving and regretting not getting the tattoo done, I think it took probably about three more months for me to build up that courage 
and go back into a tattoo shop. Now, I didn't go back to the same place because I was too embarrassed at the time. Now, again, I wasn't the brightest when it came to tattoos at this time, so I didn't do research again. It was just a group of people that I knew going to get tattoos done, and I was like, you know what? It's a big group of people. Maybe if I go with them and see them getting the tattoos on some, it was their first, first experience too. Seeing them get it done, I could probably build up the courage even more. So, went to this tattoo shop. It was my turn, and I sat down. It was hard to get myself to sit in the tattoo chair, but I sat down. But mind you, I was getting a tattoo on one of the most painful spots to get a tattoo, which was the chest. Granted, it was only lettering, so it wasn't a lot of shading and detail. Now I'm sitting in the chair, the artist got everything ready. He dipped the tattoo gun in the ink. Then he asked me if I was ready, said yeah, and then the tattoo needle hit my skin. Now as soon as that tattoo needle hit my skin, I was like, are you kidding me? That was it? That's all it is. Now don't get me wrong, it did hurt. Tattoos hurt, but it wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it was going to hurt. But when it came to thinking about it and that fear building up and just not getting in the chair to do it, I'm guessing my mind made me think that it was just gonna hurt so much more than it actually did. All those months of trying to build up this courage and embarrassing myself at this tattoo shop, pretty much feeling like a complete coward, it really was all for nothing. I guess what I'm trying to say is don't get into your own head and let the fear of getting a tattoo, whatever that fear might be, stop you from getting something that you know you're really gonna love, especially if it's a tattoo that is gonna be holding a lot of meaning to you. So from a guy that, that was absolutely terrified of tattoos that now has a bunch of them, you got this. You got this. If you wanna learn more about tattoos, check out this playlist right here. And if you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell notification just so you don't miss future videos. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.